Hello everyone, this is Kim from The Beauty Biz and this week's video, I'm sharing with you a hack that I created to put beauty filters on YouTube using an Instagram hack. Now, it's a, a little bit of a process, so bear with me, but I'm going to share my screen, record, and so you can see the process. Here we are on the Instagram homepage and you are going to scroll over like you're doing a story. I want you to hit hands-free, and when we do that, the video option will show, and choose the filter of your choice. I like this one here. A girl needs a little bit of help sometimes, and once we've done that, I want you to slowly rotate your phone. That's why it looks like this, because you have to rotate it slowly. If not, you lose the filter, and proceed to film your video in this screen. Now we're going to hit captions and as they're transcribing the captions, it will come up, of course, like the um, vertical Instagram and I take the captions and sometimes I leave them in the margin over here on the right. That's one way to do it. You will hit um, save after you do this. And now we're going to open the um, gallery, check that it's there. Then I'm going to go to my InShot app and upload the clip that I just recorded. And once you get to the InShot screen, you will see I'm going to scroll all the way over to Canvas. We want the YouTube Canvas on the right over here, and I'm going to pinch and twist to turn it from a vertical video to a horizontal YouTube video. Now I check and make sure that the audio is correct. My captions are there. I'm still with the filter. And so I back out of InShot, and to create the next clip, I'm going to go back to the Instagram story, hands-free, with my filter, because they only do one-minute clips, so you have to do them one minute at a time. And I start the record process, hands-free. Now I do the second part of the video, the second clip. And once we do that, we are going to hit the captions before we save, let it transcribe. Once I have my captions, now this is a second way that I do it if you like the captions on the bottom, which is, I think, what I'm going to do in the future. And so you just line that up and you stretch it out um, until it gets into a very thin line for that. So we're going back to the InShot app. Now I'm going to add my second clip. So I go back to video, find it in my gallery, go to the canvas that has the YouTube, twist it until it fits into the frame, check that the video and the filters are correct, my captions are showing, then I will save once all the clips are added and my video is done on InShot. So, we're back to the Instagram screen. And this um, one, it looks like I have lost the filter. I ended up having to actually do this one over. Like I said, it's a tricky um thing to do, but you'd have to move the camera real slowly when you're twisting it. There's my filter. Okay, it just took a minute. Now, we're going to slowly turn the camera, and we are adding the third clip. And do these clips one minute at a time, because like I said, it's an Instagram story. You see, I've caught my filter again. It's a very tricky scenario to get the YouTube filters right. Twist very slowly. So once again, we go back to captions, grab our captions, and let them transcribe until we see them on the screen. 
So once we see them on the screen, we're going to twist and turn to get the captions where we want them. And once we have done this, we go back and we save after the captions. So now we have three clips created. So now that we've got three clips, which is the basis of the video, we're going to grab, I don't know why that turned upside down, but you can still grab it nonetheless, back to the InShot app. We're going to add the third and final clip hit video that we have saved in a draft, grab it from my gallery, and proceed to do the YouTube canvas and twist and turn it, pinch it and turn it into the frame again. This is a very simple process when you get the hang of it. It's kind of tricky at first. The main tip I would have is to turn your uh, phone slowly so you don't lose the Instagram filter. And you can do any Instagram filter of your choice. I have tried this over and over and I kind of stumbled upon it accidentally. I was just playing around trying to see what I could find with that. Okay, screen record is going to stop. Hold on. Was that not a really fun hack? You guys, if you like it, just leave me a comment below and let me know so. And if you'd like me to share more of my content on how I film my videos for YouTube and how I use my beauty filters, just leave a comment below. And there's so much good stuff coming from the beauty biz. You guys stay tuned. But you know, at my age, I had to do something. So I figured out a hack to be able to do this. And I am so pleased with the results. You guys, as always, I love you. Till next time. Much love.